Brett is feeling that pressure. It's gonna fall to EU spread. Hellfire and Janice, one of these three is time to win. Bang, Raleigh, North Carolina, FNCS Invitational, Man City Fortnite, we've got the whole squad playing, Scram with Chimp, Threats with Alice, Hellfire with Falconer. Let's get to it, people. Hello there, and welcome to FNCS Invitational 2022, live here in Raleigh, North Carolina! of the best duos around the world, representing seven regions, will not just be duking it out for the million dollar prize pool. They won't just be fighting for the pride and prestige. They're gonna be fighting for that trophy right there. The battle bus is ready. Let's go, Jacob. Hellfire, Falconer, new duo, you know, pairing up with one another. Not only does it get you elimination points, it gets you the storm surge, so you don't have to worry about it later in the game as Chimp and Scram trying to get things going for them. Sentin is gonna fall to EU Scram. Both King and Hellfire getting an elimination each, taken out one of EU's exciting teams. As Hellfire King finds Booga and down he goes. Day one didn't go that well or as planned, but we had some communication issues because my teammate doesn't speak the same language as me. Day one didn't go completely how we wanted to, but uh, we did some practice yesterday and hopefully we can do a comeback today. Day one went a bit better than expected. We were starting to get a bit more comfortable with each other. Hopefully we can do better today. Chimp and Scram finding success here on the day. They had a top finish yesterday. They're looking to replicate that some way, shape or form. Falconer in Hellfire. Managed to execute a big elimination here. Here we have it, the final game. Whoa! What is this? What is this? Break through the wall. Shot's gonna be fired. And they do it. Become legends on top. Okay, leg two of the trip. We're in Atlanta for Dreamhack solos. Invitational didn't really go as planned, so hopefully we can bring some results home here. Okay, Drew Mac Atlanta day two. Unfortunately, had some tech issues yesterday, so the boys weren't able to get through to finals, but two more heats today to qualify. Let's hope they can get the job done. already and he's not done yet. This guy has shown himself here in the finals and I think he's still got a little bit more up his sleeve than he is yet to show. Yeah, I think you're absolutely right, Fred. Definitely a threat. Just said his name in tail. And that might just secure him and even later say here in game number three. Oh, and an elimination! You know, I'm gonna be honest with you, Threat's living up to his name, man. He's yep. the biggest threat on the leaderboard to Queasy, but when it comes to consistency. Yeah, unfortunately for all these other players, you gotta be careful because Threat is on the hunt. Again, we're looking at that top five, wondering who's gonna be the one to truly pop and solidify their position in first place. Bit of a bittersweet ending to our USA Tour. Threats finishing up eighth, really good result, but you can't help but wonder what could have been. Next up, we'll be flying out to Denmark and road tripping to Sweden with all the boys, so we'll catch you there. Peace. All right, we're on the ferry on our way to Sweden for Dreamhack. It's really cold, but uh, we'll get there soon. Win Sweden, you should be behind me, and I can only mean one thing, Dreamhack winter. We're playing Heat 1 and Heat 2, let's see if we call. I'll say I'm feeling pretty confident, so I hope I get a good result. If my uh, if my strategy works, then hopefully I'll do I'll do good. I have a pretty good plan, and I'm in mid map. Should be fairly easy. Happy G 
Jams is also in here going against Threat. I spoke to Threat yesterday. He was super confident about being able to fight off spawn and beat pretty much anyone who contested him here. And it seems like it's going relatively even. The same HP for all teams involved. Managing to slow things down, reload that shotgun. The Ranger shotgun is so difficult in this situation. It only has one shot in the tag, then you have to reload. So if you miss, it's wraps for you. Deco. Yeah, that many people will be expecting to do well. Taking a bit of damage there from Scram as he looks to get his way on out. Ripey, Hellfire, and Janice. One of these three is time to win. Hellfire's in the worst spot. He's in mid-ground. He's got one above, one below. All angles, all eyes on him, but all shots up. Oh! He connects. He hits a max damage shots. Now the 1v1. It's Hellfire versus Janice left up on high ground. He's got the med mist, and he's going to decide to play zone. He's jumping back. He's got time up on Jan up on height. Janice also has the med mist. This is a battle of time. The heels going off back and back. Down to 10, down to 5. Nothing. He's found him. He knows where he is, but can he chop through? Can he get in time? Does he have the more white HP? It starts to tick down the play of the time, and no, Janice going to win game number one. There was a about one second between Ooh. them. Dream Rack Winter 2022 is a wrap. And with that, Fortnite lands for 2022 a wrap. Bit of a tough weekend. The boys played really, really well in the qualifiers. Struggled a bit with the lag and the cues in the finals. Been a pretty special year. Our first ever full year in Fortnite. First year properly back to land in Fortnite. It's been a pleasure. And we'll see you hopefully very, very soon. Peace.